Nothing will stand in our way. I will finish what you started. Hey guys, Junior here, and welcome to a another video, and I'm going to review the Combat Pack 2 for Mortal Kombat X. I know this was pretty late in judgment. Sorry, I had to or something. Anyway, I know this is pretty late, but I just wanted to do it for you guys, because I did a, I was supposed to do a character reveal, but I forgot, and I'm sorry about that. But anyway... Let's get started with our first person to pop out in the combat pack to Leatherface. So, my thoughts on him, I am actually pretty excited for this character. I'm actually pretty keen on this character because I thought, oh my god, he looks awesome with those chainsaws. I was scared of him when I, when I saw the Texas Chainsaw Massacre franchise and it was pretty odd to me. I got scared of him, and then when I got to see the 3D remake of it, I I think he was a pretty cool character. A nice, unique war character that faces leather. Leather face. So, anyway, I get to see him in action in Mortal Kombat X, so I see if... What's he gonna do with the chainsaw variation? Like, I don't know, a chainsaw variation? The mask killer variation whatever I think the two widely accepted the two widely agreed on variation for me the first variation will be will not be slasher which we already have Jason for slasher so I'm gonna say I'm gonna say uh, I'm gonna say chainsaw variation because where he's gonna have his chainsaw and his awesome chainsaw and stuff so that's what I'm gonna say that's only a variation that I can think of maybe I'll do a variations video discussing which variation for each of the combat pack 2 characters will have so now next up is is the cyborg person that took sector's head in the we now we all know his name is triborg which will take on three separate variations of each of the characters. So the first will be the default will be will be Robot Smoke. His so we're gonna have smoke in the game which I am happy about because I always wanted smoke to be in Mortal Kombat X. And now we get the robot version of smoke which kinda I want human smoke but if we can get whatever we can get. We can take whatever we can get. So so now Triborg so the second one will take on the variation of Sector which will, be the sec will probably be the second variation, or third. So, he's going to have probably the rocket launchers and stuff, much like Sector does in Mortal Kombat 9. Same for Cyrax, he might have the blade that, that he switches for his arm. Then, we have the nets and stuff for Cy Cyrax in the third or second variation. It will be awesome. And, man, I forgot my ratings for Leatherface. So, for the second, for being Leather, for the first... For Letterface, I give him a solid at nine, which I want to play him a lot because it's awesome, and I expect gameplay videos to be coming on my channel very soon. I'm getting a PS4; it's right around the corner, so I might play Black Ops 3, Mortal Kombat X. Let me know in the comments which game you want me to play. So now, on a scale of one to ten or X, I give Triborg an X because I want to play a Smoke and Cyrax. That's what I want to do. I, I don't love S S Sector. He's kind of he's kind of a douche. Anyway, so on a scale of one to X, a nice X will be because I love him and he's awesome. Okay, so the third one, which I'm not, I was skeptical, but maybe I want to play. I guess is Bo Raicho. I know when I played earlier Mortal Kombat games, I consider Bo Raicho a complete joke because he's more a joke character. But now, yeah, I'm kind of iffy on him because I see him in the Mortal Kombat X comic. He seems like a nice guy, a cool guy, and stuff. Not like much of a joke anymore because he trained Kung Lao and Liu Kang, which I'm not, which I'm pretty sure sounds fine, but whatever. 
And I was pretty sad we didn't get either Fujin or other people like Serena, Lime, or any of those characters. But we got Bo Raicho. He's he's gonna stay. Doesn't matter. I hope he doesn't have farting techniques. Ugh, that was gross. Anyway, but on the scale of one to X, I give Bo Raicho an a seven. I'm not too keen on him, and I'm probably not gonna play him. So. My bad. Lots of things. Anyway, last one, and I'm really excited for this, is Alien or Xenomorph from the Alien or Alien vs. Predator franchise. And I literally can't wait for this character. Because now, for his variations, probably, I don't know his variations, but he's going to have the Baraka Blades. Or Tarkatan Blades. I consider them Baraka Blades, in my opinion. But anyway, Xenomorph, I can't wait for this character. He is such a beast of a character. And I love when he just popped out of Baraka's chest. That little alien thing. And it's awesome. So, on a scale of 1 to X, I give the alien or Xenomorph a X. I want to play him so very much. Thank you NetherRealm Studios. Thank you so much. Anyway anyway, it's always fun to see it. So coming back to I can't wait for this game or DLC so now on a scale of one thanks for the whole characters list it's gonna be a nine. Yes I wanna play is Triborg and Xenomorph but that's it. Baraicho and Leatherface. Leatherface I want to play, but Baraicho, no. So anyway, that's all, f that's all for the comment pack too, and what I think about it. If you enjoy, slap that like button. Sorry. Sorry if my volume's low, I'll probably fit up a notch. So, thank you all for watching. And anyway guys, but before I go, I put up a new profile picture that shows because I am part of the dark side. So, and my second channel will be full on videos about my daily life and all that other stuff very soon. And you see that I have the lights on on that one. So my main channel will have the dark side on it, dark side picture. The Fiend has joined the dark side. So if you want to join the light side or dark side, go on Google and see choose your side on the bottom when you go on search. So it's going to be awesome. It's awesome. And I joined the dark side and I can't wait to review The Force Awakens. So check that out. So thank you all for watching. My name is Azrael. Join the dark side and I will see you all next time. Peace out.